You guys ready for another unboxing? Let's get into it. Hello and welcome. What's up everybody? Thank you for clicking on the video. That's right, today we're doing yet another unboxing, but don't worry, I think you guys are gonna be into this one. I got some cool stuff to show you. Multiple packages here got dropped off at the house today and I thought, why not open them on camera with you guys? But really quick before we get into that, if this is your first time watching, please consider subscribing to the channel. Help us color in the bar and hit that 100K. We're on a mission trying to hit 100,000 subscribers and obtain that elusive silver play button. We're ripping right up on 13K any minute now, but the ultimate goal is to color in all the bars crack that 100k and get that silver play button in our hands so love to have you guys riding with me turn those notification bells on so you catch all my future content as soon as it goes live put out new videos here all the time on the channel both from here in the garage and out there on the water fishing but enough about that let's get off into opening these packages and I'll show you guys what I got in the mail today I'm gonna start with this little guy right here nothing too extreme in here but it is fishing related so let's crack off into it take a look last time I was out on the water I noticed that I was about to run out of these only had one left in the boat so I hopped online and I ordered me a fat pack of Gamakatsu 4 aught EWG extra wide gap 4 aught worm hooks. These are my favorite light wire worm hooks. If I need a heavy wire hook, I usually use the 6 cent stout 3 aught and 4 aught hooks. But when I'm going light wire, I like the Gamakatsus. So I hopped online, ordered me 25 of those bad boys. Just your standard 4 aught EWG from Gamakatsu. My favorite light wire worm hooks. I use these a lot. I go through a lot of these and I didn't want to run out. So I had to stock up. So that's that. 4 aught worm hooks. Nothing too exciting. The next package here I am excited about. This right here is actually from our friends over at Bird Blades. For those of you that watch my videos on the regular, you guys have probably noticed that I often bust out this little bad boy right here to cut open packages. This is the Bottle Butcher from Bird Blades. And believe it or not, the dude that makes these actually saw one of my videos and he hit me up on Instagram and said he wanted to send me something as a thank you for showing him love in the vids. And that's what this is right here. So we're gonna crack off into the package and see what he sent us. Shout outs to Bird Blades for showing love. See what we got. No way, dude, that's sick. Check out that t-shirt, awesome. I'll definitely be rocking this bad boy tomorrow. Nice, Berg Blades, Arizona, established 2013. Sweet, dude, thanks for the t-shirt, Berg Blades. Let's see if there's anything else in this package. Felt like there was something else in here. Oh, there's a little note. Got a little note here, let's read it. Thanks for the shout out. I love the positive energy you put into your videos. Keep it up, the world needs it. Matt Westberg, that's what's up, man. Shout outs to Matt, thank you so much for the letter. That's awesome, man. I always try to keep it positive and uplifting and all of my videos. I agree with Matt. The world does need more of it, especially right now in these difficult times that we're all living in. But it feels like there's something else in here. And if it's what I think it is, man, you went above and beyond, dude. You didn't have to do this. Oh, there's two more things in here. First off, let's pull out this little bag. What's this? Got some stickers. We got some slaps. Berg Blade stickers. Let's check them out. Dude, you went above and beyond, man. BB, Berg Blades. Check that one out. That is sick. Awesome. And then I got a few of these right here as well. Too cool, man. Thank you so much for the stickers. In fact, I'm gonna take this one right here, throw it on the subscriber board right now. There we go. Now Berg Blades has a permanent spot in frame in the videos. Much love, man. Thank you so much. And like I said, if this other item in this bag is what I think it is, man, I wanna be blown away. Look at this. What could this be? No way, dude. No way. Yep, it is. He did it, man. Too cool, Matt. Thank you so much, dude. He sent us another bottle butcher, man. I can't believe it. Check it out. The updated version, the tan handle, and the black blade. Dude, bottle butcher number two, supreme heater right there. Now we got two. Check that out, man. Rocking the OG and the new tan with black blade. Bottle Butchers from Berg Blades. That's at Berg Blades on Instagram. You guys go give him a follow, show him some love. Thank you so much for the package, man. This means a lot. I can't believe you sent me another knife, man. I'm super stoked on that. Dude is an insanely talented knife maker. You guys go check him out. The Bottle Butcher is just one of the many products that he offers and his full size pocket knives are insanely awesome you guys go check them out man thank you so much for the bottle butcher stoked on that stoked on the t-shirt stoked on the stickers man you know we're gonna be tagging these up all over everything be wearing this t-shirt tomorrow awesome dude and shout outs to berg blades matt westberg much appreciated brother thank you so much awesome all right next up we're gonna get into some hot ticket items here i'm excited for this one you know what we might as well use the new bottle butcher to cut into this package. Show you guys how sharp these things are. Dude, 
yeah, straight out of the box, just heater. I've been using my other one for a while. I've never sharpened it. It's still so sharp. I mean, you just breathe on the package with the bottle butcher. Psh, no issue. Freaking awesome. Oh yeah, forgot to show you guys. They all come with their own custom Kydex sheath that I just threw across the table. Psh, custom molded Kydex. Just like that right there, man. Fits right in. Hold your bottle butcher nice and snug. Awesome. One, two, Malibu. They're super sharp. This right here, I'm excited to show you guys. It's fishing related. I pulled that out upside down as per usual, but what is that? What is that right there, guys? Boom, another. Corrado 200, a non-DC reel. Would you look at that? A non-DC reel. It's not an SLX or a Corrado DC. That's right, this is the Corrado 200K. I ordered this reel for a specific technique and if you guys wanna see what it is, if you wanna see me rig this up, if you wanna see what baits I'm gonna be throwing with this reel, subscribe to the channel. The next video that I put out will be me setting this thing up, rigging it up, and tying on a fresh bait with some fresh line and I'll show you guys exactly what I'm gonna be doing with this new Shimano Corrado 200K. But for right now, let's go ahead and crack off into the box, take a look at the reel. This is actually my second Corrado K. The first one that I have, I got for frogging, and I've only used it a little bit, but man, I have loved every minute of using it. So when I was looking around and I needed another reel for this certain technique, I decided to go with another one of these heaters. Check that bad boy out. Boom. Corrado K. Extremely rugged, proven design, just a beast of a reel, super reliable, and I'm stoked to add another one to the lineup. I had one rod sitting over here off camera that I didn't have a reel for. It's the last rod that I have in the arsenal that I didn't have a reel mounted up to. That's why I got this thing. Now every heater is gonna have its own heater, and like I said, we're gonna be setting it up with a new technique, with some fresh line, and I'll be showing that to you guys in the next video. Subscribe to the channel if you wanna see what I'm going to be using this reel for. But yeah, the Corrado 200, another Shimano. Who would've thought? Boom. Stoked on that, man. Also really stoked on the Bottle Butcher, man. One more time, shout out to Bird Blades. Thank you so much for the package. I didn't even really get to look at the reel. Isn't that what you do to make sure a reel's good? Spin the handle really hard? That's what everybody does, right? I don't know. Woo, it's a heater. I think this is gonna work well for what I'm gonna use it for. I'm gonna set this off to the side. We'll keep rolling with this unboxing. Getting into the fishing equipment now. And I actually already opened one of the packages accidentally off camera. But if you guys want a little hint as to what we're gonna be using that reel for and what we're gonna be doing in the next setup video, I'm gonna show you guys this right here. Real quick, there's a look at this. What could we possibly need this for? Take a close look, take in all the information. There's that, I'm gonna set this over here by the reel. Stay tuned for the next video. I'll show you guys what we're gonna be doing with that stuff. But now, let's get off into the real fun of the video. You guys know the deal. Heaters only, six cents fishing. That is what is in this box. Got some new stuff to show you guys. Got a brand new bait that just dropped that we're gonna take a look at and some other fun stuff that I ordered. And I know you guys are ready for me to crack off through this box. So I'm gonna quit wasting time and we're gonna do that now. Once again, I'm gonna use this brand new bottle butcher from Bird Blades. Slice off into this bad boy. Let's do it. This thing is so sharp. It's a heater. Yeah. Heaters only from Bird Blades, man. Awesome. Stoked. All right, let's crack into the box, see what we got. First stuff out of here. Six cents soulless gloves. UV protective gloves, keep those hands protected from the sun. I don't normally wear gloves, but once I saw these and learned a little bit more about them, Tackle Warehouse actually did a little video on these. They were talking about some of the benefits and man, they sold me, I had to hop online and order me a pack, pull these bad boys out. Go ahead and throw one on, see how she feels. Oh yeah, that's nice, dude. That's nice. Awesome, got that nice, like, I don't know. I don't know if it's like a suede or padding right there around your palm. So I got this nice pull tab right here. Fit really well, feels nice and comfortable. Go ahead and throw the other one on, why not? Just make sure they didn't give me two right hands. Boom. Awesome. The Sixth Sense Solus UPF 50. Take a look at the card. UPF 50 polyester spandex fabric, microfiber suede palm for strength. So that is suede, I was right. Finger and wrist pull tabs. So you got a finger pull tab right here. Oh, that's what that is. I was wondering what that little loop was right there. So you got the little loop. That's to help you get it off without having to turn your glove inside out. That's cool. And you got the little palm pull tab there. Moisture wicking and fish dry fabric. Awesome. 
Six Sense Soulless Gloves. Check them out, man. SixCenseFishing.com. I guess now is as good a time as any to mention that JR10 for the win. You guys know the deal. If you're interested in picking up any of this stuff that you're gonna see in this video for yourself, SixCenseFishing.com, JR10 at checkout. That's gonna save you 10% off of everything that you see here in this video and everything on the website for that matter. The rods, the baits, the gear, the gloves, the shirts, the hats, the heaters, everything, man. 10% off with JR10 at checkout. Thank you guys so much for the support. I appreciate you all. When you use that code, it directly supports Supports what we have going on over here on the channel. So if you like what you're seeing and you're wondering how you can support, that is how you do it. SixCenseFishing.com, JR10 for the win, heaters only. Let's get off into the box, show you guys what else I got. Next up, these right here are gonna be Divine Jig Heads. I got a few different colors and a couple different weights. These right here, perfect for the Divine Swim Baits. And I'm gonna show you guys exactly how to rig these up right now. Show you what I'm gonna be doing with them. These right here, 3 16 ounce. I'm gonna be using these for the small size baits. They're three odd size hooks. Also got some quarter ounce. These are four odd size hooks. I'm gonna be using these for the mid range baits. And then for the larger stuff or anytime I need a little bit heavier weight, I got the 3 8 of an ounce, five odd hook. These are all swim bait jig heads. Let's check them out. Go up here to the tackle wall, grab us a little pack of Divine Swim Baits. These right here are the Pro Shad, one of my favorite colors. 3.8 inch, pull one of these bad boys out of here. Just a soft plastic paddle tail swim bait. Let's grab one of these quarter ounce jig heads. Forgot to tell you guys the colors. This is Sexified Shad. We'll take a look at the other ones in a minute. There's a look at that. Supreme Hook, Screw Lock, high quality painted jig head. That signature flat chin on there, perfect for skipping up under docks. I love the Screw Lock system. The best bait keeping system in the game, I believe. The Six Cent Swim Jig also features the Screw Lock system, and that is the bait that helped me fall in love with Six Cent Fishing products. Once I started using it, I went on from there, started buying their crank baits, their hard baits, and everything else in the lineup, and just absolutely fell in love. And that is how I got started down the road of Six Cents. This little dude right here made a believer out of me. Let me show you guys why. Let's take this thing and rig it up. And there she blows, dudes. That's the deal. Quarter ounce swim bait jig head, 3.8 inch Divine swim bait and pro shad. And that right there is gonna be a killer bait fish imitation. Anytime they're maybe a little finicky and won't hit a swim jig, this is a great option. I'm gonna swim this around the marinas, in boat slips, in the shade, and up shallow. And that bad boy right there is sure to stick a monstro. And yeah, that's gonna do work, man. There's the setup, that's the heater right there. That is why I ordered these things, so that I could rig up a bunch of these, go out there and throw some swim baits, smaller profile swim baits. We'll go back through the colors. That was the sexified shad. That's the live shad right there. And this right here is the baby shad. Fitting, the 3 16 baby shad. This will be for the really small swim baits, like the 3.3 inch or even the 2.8 inch Kitex. Yeah, wanted to cover all the bases. 3 aught, 4 aught, 5 aught, Divine Jig Head, Swim Bait Heads. You know the deal. Pair those up. JR10 for the win. Heaters only. That bad boy right there is going to get it done. There's a bee on me. I don't know, he flew somewhere. Let's keep rocking and rolling through this unboxing. All right, now I got some hard baits to show you guys. Some colors that I didn't already have. Crush 50X in Live Shiner. Check that thing out. Boom, straight heater. Crush 50X, this is my favorite square built crankbait. 3 8 ounce, dives two to five feet. Live Shiner, killer color. I was out there smashing them this summer on the Live Shiner Speed Wake, wake bait. So I wanted to pick up a Crush 50 in this color. Just a supreme heater right there. <laughs> Awesome. Next up, this is another one of my favorite colors. Supernatural Shad Greens. Just a really toned down, natural looking, grayish white, a little silver, a little bronze action there on the head. Go ahead and crack it open, why not? Shad Greens, there's the heater. A little bronze action on the nose. Super realistic 3D eyes, molded in gill plates, molded in scales. Dark silver there on top. Crush 50 in Shad Greens. Like I said, these were all colors that I didn't already have in the arsenal, so I'm always shopping sixcentsfishing.com. Always looking for new stuff to add to the boat. Let's take a look at this next one. This next one right here is kind of like the Live Shiner, but a little bit more vibrant. This is that Shad Streaker. When I saw this on the website, I had to pick this up, dude. That right there. Nice baby bass looking. It's got that red eyes. Could uh, be a, maybe even a baby Guadalupe bass. I have a lot of guads in my lake, so that right there is gonna be an awesome option. Check out those 3D realistic scales, blinging and blanging. Red eyes, chartreuse sides, dark green pumpkin top. Yeah, white belly, and of course, laser sharp high quality black nickel hardware and hooks. Shad Streaker Crush 50. 
Next up, this one right here probably looks familiar to some of you guys. This is old Chester Cheeto. Caught a lot of fish here on the channel with this bait right here. And I actually have a bunch of these in the arsenal already. So I ordered this to give away to one of you guys. So here's the deal. If this video can get 500 likes, I'm gonna give this away. All you have to do to win this bad boy is click thumbs up on the video. Make sure you're subscribed to the channel. Go down below and leave me a comment. As soon as we hit 500 likes on the video, I'm gonna go down below, pick somebody at random to win this free heater. If we don't get 500 likes here on the video, I'm gonna give it away over there on Instagram. So either way, this is going to one of you guys. Make sure you follow me on Instagram at the Justin Royal. This heater right here is for one of you. That's the Radiation Croc Crush 50. Old Chester Cheeto, probably my favorite color in this model. Absolute dominator. Come fall time, this is gonna smash somebody a monstro, man. So go down below, click that thumbs up button, help me boost the algorithm, subscribe to the channel and leave me a comment if you want your shot at winning this thing. And if not, I'll just give it away over there on my Instagram. Either way, this is going to one of you guys. Just as a way for me to say thank you and also a way for us to hopefully get more people to be able to see these videos. Like I said at the beginning, I am trying to grow the channel and get eventually to 100,000, but I can't do it without you. I need all the help I can get. So I appreciate you all for taking the time to watch, engage, sub the channel, leave me comments and show me all the support that you guys always show me. You guys are incredible, awesome. You always keep it positive. I love interacting with you guys. I love all the positivity and love and support that you guys send my way. Can't thank you enough. So much love, I appreciate you all. Got another Crush 50 here though to show you. Check this out. This is a color that I'm sure a lot of you have seen. This is the Gillikin Crush 50. Shout outs to Ben Milliken. This is his custom color. It's a bluegill imitation, sunfish imitation. Really nice, natural, detailed. Looks like a custom paint, but it's not. All six cents colors look like a custom paint, but they're not. High quality Supreme Heater paint apps at an affordable price. Check that thing out, man. That's awesome. It's got those bronze accents on there. You can barely see. Really nice sunfish pattern. Super natural looking, highly detailed bait. Looking forward to throwing this one. I know that's going to stick us one right there. Didn't have a Crush 50 in the Gillikin, so I wanted to add one to the arsenal. Got one more Crush 50 in here, and then I'm gonna show you guys a brand new bait from the six that just dropped and just became available. This one right here, I think you guys are really gonna like. I ordered this one just because it was fun, man. I have a little peg up there on the tackle wall full of baits that are so vibrant and crazy looking. I'm not even sure that I'll ever throw them. I just like to add them to my collection, and this one right here is one that I didn't have in the collection. It looks so awesome. I'm gonna open it up and pull it out of the box before I even show you guys, and then I'll tell you what it is really quick. Boom, check that thing out. This is the Rambo Chartreuse Crush 50. Dude, look at that thing. Check out the eyes on that bad boy and just look at that paint app. Awesome, dude. Super bright Chartreuse, red accents, orange belly, bronze top with a black back, and those eyes. Dude, the eyes are just insane looking. That right there is a straight heater. Murky water domination. So excited to add this to the collection. Don't know if I'll ever throw that. I fish super clear water. This right here might be a little bit too vibrant for the kind of waters that I generally fish but if I ever head out into some Merc, chances are I'll have this in the boat with me, man. That is an awesome looking bait, man. I could not resist. I've seen it on the website for a while and I was like, yeah, that probably isn't the right color for me in the type of water that I generally fish. This last time I was shopping around, I was like, man, forget it. I'm pulling the trigger on that Rambo Chartreuse. That thing is just too cool looking, man. Awesome, awesome looking bait. All right, last out of the box right here. Brand new bait from the six, just dropped. The Mega Worm. No, I'm just kidding. It's the Ridge Worm. This is the Ridge Worm from Sixth Sense, man. Brand new bait, large profile worm. It's gonna be excellent for throwing in the summertime. You can rig this thing so many different ways. I'm about to break one out and show you. The color on these are Plum Melon Magic. Let's take a look, man. The brand new Ridge Worm from Sixth Sense Fishing. Super unique, very different type of worm. Not like any other that I've ever seen. Shorter body with a huge soft plastic wiggly, wriggly tail on there. Check that thing out, man. This is gonna be great for it. Texas rigging, Carolina rigging, they just released some underwater footage of this thing. Oh, they even got a synth on them, man. That's like, that's new. I don't think I've ever smelled a soft plastic from them that smells like that, man. That smells a little, hmm, smells a little licorice -y or something, man. Proudly designed and made in the USA. I love that right there, man. Made in America. Powered by Sixth Sense Lure Lab. Plum Melon Magic Ridge Worm from Sixth Sense Fishing. Look at that thing, man. Yeah, like I said, man, the underwater footage that they put out looked incredible. And I think one way that I would like to fish this thing is on a shaky head. Let's go ahead and rig one up right now and take a look at what that looks like. I happen to have a shaky head sitting right over here with a divine shaky worm on it, but I'm gonna go ahead and pull that off. I'm gonna screw this ridge worm onto that bad boy. See what this thing looks like on there. The new ridge from the six. Brand new soft plastic bait just hit the market. You know I had to grab me some. Boom, check that out, dude. 
Check that bad boy out. That tail, it's gonna give off so much awesome action under the water, man. Boom, I'm gonna throw that thing. I'm definitely throwing that thing. Like I said, guys, you can rig this up so many different ways. Texas rig it, shaky head, Carolina rig. The options are endless with the ridge worm. I can't wait to get out there and fish with this thing. Show the fish something that they've never seen before, something totally different. Looks like kind of like a mix in between a worm and a leech. And that is just awesome, dude. Check that thing out. Check out that plum magic color. Looks like a dark motor oil brown mixed with a little bit, just a touch of like chartreuse green pumpkin with blue, gold, and turquoise flake in there. Oh, looks like maybe pink. Yeah, pink flake in there as well. Natural, but also a vibrant color. It's gonna do well in all water conditions, man. Check that thing out. The new Ridge Worm from Six Sense Fishing. Boom. Got two packs of those bad boys. Coming in hot with the new baits, man. New bait drops all the time. Brand new, innovative heaters coming at you live and direct in full effect over there from Six Sense Fishing. Like I mentioned, if you guys are interested in scooping any of these baits for yourself, sixcentsfishing.com, that is where you go. But make sure you use my code JR10. Save the bread 10% off of everything you saw in this video from the six, man. Make sure you guys stay tuned. You're gonna see what I'm gonna do with this reel. We're gonna get it loaded up and ready for the water in the next video. So stay ready so you don't gotta get ready. Subscribe to the channel, turn those notifications on, catch all my future content. I also encourage you to go down below the video and read around through that video description. There are multiple ways to support the channel down there if you feel so inclined, but I do appreciate you guys taking time out of your day to watch my videos. I hope you're all staying safe, sane, and healthy out there in this crazy world that we're living in. That about does it. That about wraps her on up. So I'm going to say goodbye for now, and I'll see you on the next one.